Okay, so I've never interviewed anyone before, and I'm not an interviewer. Um, I think we should start by quick questions, short answers. How yeah. much does being Irish affect your music? I think, you know, it's like there's a certain madness about Irish people. And do you feel home when you go back there? When you're in America, you're traveling the world and doing your tours, where do you, where do you feel is, do you always feel yeah, Ireland's home? Yeah, I think, I think just simply like the weather makes you feel like docked again, you know. Big boobs, little boobs. Um, big boobs, little boobs. Uh, little boobs. Blonde hair, brunette. Uh, Auburn. <laughs> um, okay, why did we become friends? Um, I, I think because we uh, like each other. <laughs> why else? You know, nice. it's like, you know, like I, th I, I think you get an instinct when you meet someone very quickly in a room, you know, you know, I mean, it's like I was saying that certain people can change the energy in the room or they can, you know, uh, yeah, it's like a ship docking in a harbour or something like that. You just, the harbour opens, you know. What about those fingernails? Because if um, you were my boyfriend and your right hand had fingernails like that, I'd have need to worry. How does Laura deal with that? Well, I use the left. <laughs> right, fine enough answer. What means the most to you? What means the most? Yeah, if, you were to, if, you, if someone said you're going to die in a week, what would you do? If I had seven days to live, um, I'd probably, you know, tell, tell everybody that I love them and, uh, you know, see it the next... Uh, you wouldn't want to write the best song you'd ever written ever in your life? Or would you feel that was too much pressure that you'd done that already? Yeah, but I sort of felt discover. like 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 even when I done the end of history, it was called the end of history. I wasn't sure that I was going to make another record again, you know. Mm -hmm. So like you take a song, like put a penny in the slot. I was putting every single thing into that, you know. Uh, flashes of childhood, where I was at at that period of time, you know. What I mean? mm -hmm. And like every time that I've gone to do a record, it feels like that is the last seven days, you know. Oh. What's your favourite song ever? Can I choose one? And then if someone asked me that, I'd go. Ah. That's hard, you know. But I like I like the song "Hide Your Love Away." You know, here I stand, head <laughs> in hand. Favourite colour? Colour red. Favourite month? Month. Um, August. Favourite number? Number three. Favourite day of the week? Day of the week. Uh, um, it used to be, it changes, like I was saying, things change. It used to be Friday, but now it's Sunday. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. That's interesting. My dad, he, he, said, he taught me, he said, you can use certain chords to, um, to make people feel a certain emotion. That's why the cello or the violin, they have certain like, sounds. I quite like that. Like E. You like E? <laughs> <laughs>